Hello, hello, everybody. Adam here with another lesson. This is for A, uh, as you can see behind me in the book. Uh, just remember, turn on the subtitles in Korean or Mongolian, Vietnamese, whatever your first language is, just to understand a little more clearly. Um, these videos are here to help, as I always mention. And just remember, do a little bit of homework. You don't have to do it all. Just make sure you understand what we're doing in class. And yep, one more English zone before the end of the semester, before the final exam, and you will be getting the highest mark possible for that. So let's get started. I'm going to disappear to make it look a little bit nicer. And let's get started. Okay, so let's watch the video. Um, as usual, we don't watch this in class, but they're nice. And let's get started. Hi, I'm Leah. I'm a first year college student. I'm studying business here at the university. I'm very busy and my friends are too. Here's a look at what we're doing today. This is my roommate, Sophia, and our friend, Dan. They're in the library right now. Sophia's studying history, so she's always busy reading and writing papers. I think that she's working on a research project. Here's my classmate, Emil. He's exercising. He's on the soccer team, so he spends a lot of time at the gym. And there's Renee. She's eating lunch and talking on the phone before class. Some of the classes here are big, but this one is pretty small. My professor is teaching us new math theories. I think it's really interesting. Not all of my friends agree with me though. After class, I see my friend Paolo. It's nice out, so we're sitting outside and doing homework. Paolo is studying for a test tomorrow. And, of course, we're drinking coffee. A college student is always drinking coffee. Life here is busy, but it's also very interesting. I really like it here. So this video is actually more useful than most. Um, because it's going to, you know, it talks about the activities and also the grammar, the ING, things you're doing now, right? So it says, look at the activities in the box. Uh, watch your teacher act out the meaning. Well, we won't do that here, but, you know, drinking, eating, exercising, studying, talking, and teaching. Okay. Now we don't need to watch it again, but we can just go through and again, these are the activities and the grammar that we will focus on for this unit. So Leah is business. Well, she is studying business. Sophia is studying history. Emil is exercising at the gym. Renee is eating lunch and talking on the phone. The professor is teaching a class. Paulo and Leo are studying for a test, and they're also drinking coffee. So you can see that they're all using the ING form because these are things they are describing that are happening now. Okay. And we'll talk about that many more times in this unit. So let's get started. Okay, so as I mentioned, ING, say the words in blue. I'll just quickly say them. I'll read them out. She's studying for a test. She's watching TV. He's texting a friend. She's exercising and listening to music. He's talking on the phone. He's eating pizza and drinking soda. They're going to school and she's shopping. You can notice that the B verb is here. There's always an S except for this one because they are, right? They are going out. But for all the ones, it's she's, he's, he's, she's, okay? So what are these people doing? match the sentences in A, so up here, with the sentences down here. Now I'll zoom out. If you are studying with the video, then, you know, pause it, give it a try. But I'm going to show you the answers in three, two, one. Here come the answers. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll make this a little smaller. Oh, it's hard to see, isn't it? Okay, well, 
I hope you're not watching on your phone. All right, so we'll go one by one. So the first one is she's studying for a test. That's down there, right? She's watching TV. There you go. Next one, she's texting a friend. She's exercising and listening to music. There you go down there. And he's talking on the phone down there. And he's eating pizza and drinking soda. Oh, and last one, they're going to school. Okay, Just to make it a little easier, there's the pictures. But again, it doesn't look that nice uh, when I zoom out this much. Okay, maybe you can take a screenshot and zoom in. But anyway, let's keep moving. But those are the activities we're working with today. Now let's do a little listening. Okay, so first it says, say the words in the word bank with your teacher. Well, that's me. Do homework. Okay, so when you're talking about homework, we say do homework. Run is just running. And wait for, that's the expression, wait for something. It says, wait for a person, wait for your friend. Or wait for something, wait for my birthday, or wait for Christmas. Okay, so let's get started. We're listen. We're going to listen to three conversation. What is happening um, in each conversation? Okay, so that's that's what we're going to focus on first. Um, let's do this. Conversation one. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thanks. Can I help you find something? Uh, yes, a phone for my mom. It's a gift. For your mother, gotcha. I like this one. Is it easy to use? Yes, it is. It's a very popular phone, and it's not expensive. So there's no answers in the book. So again, use the subtitles, but he is shopping for a phone, or you could say he's shopping for a phone for his mother. Let's continue. Conversation two. Hello? Hi, Gabby. It's Jim. Hi, Jim. How are you? Fine. Hello? What are you doing, Gabby? I'm losing you. Hi. Sorry about that. I'm running in the park. Oh, okay. Maybe now isn't a good time. Let's talk later, okay? Okay. Bye. So, yep, she's running in the park, okay? And her friend's calling her. Next one. Conversation three. Ben? Yeah? Ben, what are you doing? Who are you talking to? No one, Mom. I'm watching a video. A video? No videos now, Ben. Please, do your homework. I am. I'm watching this video as part of my homework. Oh, okay. How's it going? Fine. The video is interesting, and I'm learning a lot. Okay, so third one, he's watching a video for homework. Okay, now here it is in more detail. Um, I think we'll just listen once here and then there. Okay. Here we go. So again, the phone is, we'll just listen and pause after each one. Conversation one. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm fine. Thanks. Can I help you find something? Uh, Yes. A phone for my mom. It's a gift. For your mother, gotcha. I like this one. Is it easy to use? Yes, it is. It's a very popular phone, and it's not expensive. Okay, so the phone is, well, you got it right. It's a gift. Gift for his mom. Okay, next one. Conversation two. Hello? Hi, Gabby. It's Jim. Hi, Jim. How are you? Fine. Hello? What are you doing, Gabby? I'm losing you. Hi. Sorry about that. I'm running in the park. Oh, okay. Maybe now isn't a good time. Let's talk later, okay? Okay. 
Bye. Okay, so Gabby and Jim, right? Talk. It's the answer. Oops. Okay. Uh, oh, the phone is, yeah, a gift and popular. Anyway, Gabby and Jim talk later. Okay. And then the third one. Conversation three. Ben? Yeah? Ben, what are you doing? Who are you talking to? No one, Mom. I'm watching a video. A video? No videos now, Ben. Please, do your homework. I am. I'm watching this video as part of my homework. Oh, okay. How's it going? Fine. The video is interesting, and I'm learning a lot. And here's the last one. So Ben says the video is interesting, right, for, for that one. Okay, so there's the answers there. Um, for here, circle the conversation, right? So here, what is the man doing, right? Uh, let me grab this one. Okay, so for this one, listen to the conversation one more time. Also listen for the three answers. Choose A, B, or C. So what is the man doing, right? Um, this one's a bit tricky. Conversation one. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thanks. Can I help you find something? Uh, yes, a phone for my mom. It's a gift. For your mother, gotcha. I like this one. Is it easy to use? Yes, it is. It's a very popular phone, and it's not expensive. What is the man doing? A. He's waiting for a phone call. B. He's shopping for a phone. C. He's talking on the phone. Conversation. Okay, so I think we can agree. B, right? Shopping for a phone. All right, next one. And two. Hello? Hi, Gabby. It's Jim. Hi, Jim. How are you? Fine. Hello? What are you doing, Gabby? I'm losing you. Hi. Sorry about that. I'm running in the park. Oh, okay. Maybe now isn't a good time. Let's talk later, okay? Okay. Bye. What is Gabby doing? A. She's going to the gym. B. She's waiting for a friend. C. She's exercising. Okay, so what's Gabby doing? Well, C, right? She's exercising. Okay, here's the last one. Conversation three. Ben? Yeah? Ben, what are you doing? Who are you talking to? No one, Mom. I'm watching a video. A video? No videos now, Ben. Please, do your homework. I am. I'm watching this video as part of my homework. Oh, okay. How's it going? Fine. The video is interesting and I'm learning a lot. What is Ben doing? A. He's talking on the phone. B. He's watching a TV show. C. He's doing his homework. Okay, so I hope you got that one. He is doing his homework, which is C. Great. So there are the answers. As always, you can go back and listen. And let's keep moving on to speaking. This is something we'll do in class, right? We'll listen to it here just so you can be familiar. But yeah, we're just going to listen to it. Hello. Hey, Monique. It's Luis. Hi, Luis. How are you doing? Fine. How about you? 
So-so. Yeah? What's wrong? I'm waiting for the bus. It's late. Sorry to hear that. What are you doing, Luis? Not much. I'm watching TV. Right. So this is the other one here, waiting for, and this was the expression we did before, waiting for something, right? So Monique is waiting for the bus. And again, here's today's grammar. These are things they're doing now, right? How are you doing? And then here she says, I'm waiting for the bus. What are you doing? I'm watching TV. Okay. So they come down here, they say speaking strategy. Hi, right? Greeting people. How are you doing? Or it's fine. Okay. All right. Pretty good. These are answering and then asking the person back, right? How about you? And again, I'm fine or I'm okay. I'm all right. I'm pretty good. Now, next one is, right? Hi, how are you doing? So, so. Yeah. What, you know, if you're a little sad, so, so, or not good. Yeah. What's wrong? I'm waiting for the bus. It's late. Okay. So let's do this one because these are the little conversation things all right and first one hi how right how are you doing and so so yeah what's wrong i'm studying for the test it's hard right that's a little sad next one hi how are you doing pretty good how about you all right what are you doing? Okay, so these are just little ways of asking someone what they're doing now or how they are feeling. Okay, so let me close this and let's go over to the grammar, which we already talked about. So the grammar form today is called the present continuous affirmative, which just means yes or, you know, something I am doing, and the negative, which means something you're not doing. For example, I'm or your or he's or she's again the the I am you are he is she is we are they are but when you're speaking they say I'm your he's she's we're there right and then watching TV that's the affirmative the negative is not watching TV okay and these are the yes no and wh questions so first are you is he are they right and then this just ing and yes i am no i'm not so you have to match the be verb again right because yes i am no i'm not yes he is no he's not yes they are or no they're not okay when you're answering yes and no um what are you doing All right i'm watching tv he's watching tv okay what is he doing what are you texting or sorry who are you texting or who is he texting, right? I'm texting my friend or he's texting his friend. Okay, so these are the forms for the grammar. And just the important thing is to remember you're talking about something you are doing now, okay? Now, let's do the grammar activity here. Okay, so pause the video. Uh, let me show you this. So you can pause the video and in three, two, one, I'm going to show you the answers. Okay. All right. The first one, John. Well, John is a he. So John's, John is, right? John's watching TV with his friends. Okay. Erica and Martin. That's two people. That's a they. So Erica and Martin, Mart or they are studying, right? For a test. Next. We use this book in our English class. Well, again, we, what's the be verb? Well, we are using, right? So we are using this book in our English class. I, oh, here's the negative, right? So what do we do? Well, I'm not drinking coffee. This is tea. There's the negative, right? I'm not. Be verb, not, still ing here. And the last one, he not shop, right? He by, well, he is, right? And first it's the negative, right? So negative is he's not shopping for a new laptop. Here's the positive or the affirmative. He's buying a new phone. Okay. So if you want to take a screenshot, 
great. Then let's move on to the next activity. Here we go. So complete each conversation. Use contractions. Now, contractions are fancy words for I am, I am, right? I'll show you as we go. Oh, I should go back. Let me go back here. Take a screenshot or, you know, pause the video now. But I'm going to show you the answers in three, two, one, go. All right. So are you studying, right? So you've got you study. But here's the yes, no question. Are you studying for the test? No, I'm not. Okay. What do? So what are you doing? Answer. I'm watching TV. Next one. Is Nadia exercising? Yes, no question. No, she's not. Or no, she isn't. Both are fine. What, right? So it's kind of you. So what is she doing? Because we're still talking about Nadia. What is she doing? And she's running in the park. Again, B verb here, I-N-G. Little spelling thing, right? R-U-N-N-I-N-G. Okay, this goes back to the vowel consonant. And then one more consonant, I-N-G. Last one. Are Oscar and Fiona going, right, to school now? No, because two people. No, they're not, right, because Oscar and Fiona. And la next where are they going? Okay, so where are they going? And last one, they're going to a soccer game. Okay, so let me come back and say hi. Hello, hello, me again. So that's the end of the video part. Of course, we do the same thing in class, but we have a little more time to work together and do that kind of stuff. I just make these videos for people that want to learn and just be more comfortable. As a reminder, uh, make sure you do the uh, homework, especially if it's a little difficult in class. The homework is a great way to remember what we've studied. Thank you for the few people that, you know, give a like or say thank you. I know not many people watch this video, but I don't care. If one person watches it and it helps, I'm happy. So, all right, people, have a great week and see you in class. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.